Okay, time to play some chess. I'm going to pre-move here and hopefully I don't regret this one. There we go. Okay, let's get her. We're basically going to try to develop pieces here and then look for a spot to overload. I'm going to go for the 1-2 push where I push the D-pawn, I think. Yeah, we'll see what the engine does here. I think it probably takes. And then we will take if they take. Or if they do that, we have another option. Let's go... Let's go for the castle here. Okay, let's do that with the idea of pushing the C pawn to remove the defender. Queen might take here. Okay, Queen takes there. So, what we'll do... We're going to play, let's see, Bishop here. Uh, engine's going for the overload there. Let's go... We're going to bail on our knight. Peter doesn't take yet. A uh, number of options here. I'm just debating between this. And probably bringing another rook out. I think... Bringing another rook out might be stronger, although the position is in a little bit of trouble. Okay. Well, we've got three attackers on this knight, and of course the computer has three defenders. What I was thinking is to go here and then attack the queen. Okay, they retreated. Okay. Wanted to attack the queen here, but the knight is defending. So I think... We go here. Okay, queen takes there. I'm going to check. Let's yeah, see what they do. Okay, they brought the rook in. <coughs> Let's go here. And the idea is to attack the queen. There's a number of options now. There's a lot more options at the table. Let's attack the knight. Because if the knight moves, we can take the rook. Okay. That is kind of what we want. We're going to go there. Now, the real idea is to see if we can pin the queen to the king. And it looks like we're going to get what we want. The only way to get out of this is to check with the rook. 
and it's not going to do that. There we go. That should be enough to close this position out. Okay. Let's go there. Let's just take the rook. And then we should be able to finish this position here. Let's use this pawn for leverage. Okay, let's use this pawn for leverage as well. And then we'll do the same in just a minute. Actually, let's go here. We could push the pawn. I'm going to try to finish this with the queen, though. Okay. If they want to play that way, that's fine. We can just push. We'll get another queen. We can win that way, too. All right, let's go back here, and that should do it within a couple moves anyway. Let's see, one more move, and that should be it. Well, one more move after that. Okay, finally.